property 18504 Utica Road here in Roseville, Michigan. We have a very large colonial style house. Two and a half car to catch garage here in Roseville, Michigan. Very nice area. We're just minutes away from uh, Gratiot Avenue, which is a hub for uh, restaurants, stores, businesses. Uh, minutes away from the uh, freeways as well. We've got a church right next door and a small school. The house has been completely renovated top to bottom. We've got new vinyl siding, uh, new roof in the house, as well as the garage. See the side of it here, the vinyl windows. There's the garage there. I'll take you inside. Got fresh drywall throughout. Things ripped down to the studs. New flooring throughout. All the mechanicals have been updated. Got a nice front porch here. The overhang. New storm door, entry door. Coming through the front door here in the living room area. Just have some cardboard down there for uh, when you first come in is to wipe your feet. But uh, see window treatments, new window treatments throughout. Fresh drywall and paint, carpeting uh, here. You know what? I'll take you upstairs real quick, and then we'll end up uh, back down here. But again, fresh carpet throughout. Updated electrical throughout. New light fixtures, ceiling fans in the bedrooms. It's kind of a unique layout in this house. It's technically a three bedroom, but it could easily. Um, with a couple little bonus rooms and the way this is laid out, you can easily do uh, you know four bedrooms. But this is at the top of the stairs here. I guess technically this would all be one bedroom. And you walk through here, just like another section here. That's where your closet's at. Again, ceiling fan fixtures, smoke detectors are all up. So this would be one bedroom here. New interior doors. And over here will be bedroom number two. Again, closet space there. And again, like another little bonus nook here. Um, just additional room in this bedroom. So we got two bedrooms up. But again, if it was a family, three or four children, you could easily fit. And the one big bedroom there, you could easily fit two. And they would actually be separated as well. So we come down here, back through the living room area. This is your kitchen and dining area. You can see completely remodeled. Um, ceramic flooring. All new kitchen cabinets, backsplash, countertops. This came out really, really nice. Dining area over here. It's a storage closet there. Again, ceiling fan fixtures. Let me walk through here. Some more storage here, like a pantry closet. A bathroom here. As you can see, higher grade uh, vanity. Mirror, light fixture, brand new ceramic surround in the tub. Again, new light fixtures throughout. And then this will be bedroom number three. Camera on the main floor. And this here, I guess, technically could almost be like a walk-in closet. Um, you know, just it would be at the desire of the tenant or you know, owner of the house. Put some wire racks up in there. Shelves, closet poles. And then I'll take you down here. This is going down by the side entry here. The vinyl flooring. And then this is what we call like a Michigan basement, which is basically just like a uh, five-foot clearance. In I'm just gonna give you a quick pan from here because the ceilings are low. But I mean, it's enough where you could 
I mean, as long as, it, I think about about six, six, seven foot ceilings. We do the laundry down here. You see there, we have updated electrical service panel. There's some more storage in the back there. The hot water tank and furnace have all been updated. So not too much room for storage down here. Um, but again, it is, is a basement. This is why you're, you're, all your uh, utilities are at. Just not your, uh, not your standard basement. It's what we call a Michigan basement, which is basically just like a uh, seven foot high crawl space. And that's it here on Utica. Again, I mean, it's been updated from top to bottom. Everything's pretty much brand new in this house. And again, there, I just really love the way this kitchen came out.